first of all, I want to thank each and every one of you for all the hard work and the love and everything you poured into this campaign. We couldn't be more proud of the people that have stood by John and Elizabeth in this campaign. And you are the soldiers that have done it. Thank you. John is on his way here and he'll be here in a little bit. But we have a number of people who want to say a few words. But before they do, I'd like to say a few words as well. You know, this democracy of ours has elections and we're going through a string of them right now. But things that you have to remember is we've only had four states, right? Yeah. Forty-six more to go. Yeah. And it takes 2,025 delegates to get nominated. Now let me tell you something, just so that you remember and put this in perspective. When Bill Clinton became our nominee back in 1992, it wasn't, he didn't win his first election in the primary caucus season until the eighth state in Georgia. I mean, he didn't Woo! Win it until in April. So, the more that John Edwards gets on the stage to debate Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton and the country get to see the three of them together, the better we're going to be, the higher up. Mixer that if I 
might leave their names out, but they know who they are, who they are, and we love them and we thank them for their efforts. Carolina, who we love so much. I want to thank all those who have come from different states. We've got people here from California, from New York, from Virginia, from Michigan. We've got people all over the country that came in and we thank you for your work. And finally, I want to thank my brothers and sisters and the steel workers and the carpenters and the mine workers. Let's greet her. Linda, yeah. 